Hey, welcome to Second Chief Review. I'm Ethan. Joining me today is my lovely wife, Ashley. Today we're doing a trailer action for I'm Your Man, trailer number one. If you want to see the trailer with us, link in the description below. So, I think this is a romantic movie. Hmm. I don't know anything else about it. I don't either. Maybe it's going to be a romantic comedy? I don't know. I don't think so. I think it's going to be like a romantic drama. And somebody's going to die. It's not Titanic. Anyway, let's watch. Und ich würde gerne euch den Trailer zu meinem neuen Film Ich bin dein Mensch vorstellen. I'm Dan Stevens and this is the trailer for my new film I'm Your Man. Please enjoy. He was just showing off and speaking German. Da steht ein Mann. Ach der, das ist kein Mann. Das ist ein Roboter. What? Oh, he's a robot. Okay. Die testen mich, scannen mein Gehirn. Multiple choice, ohne Ende. Und was kommt dann dabei raus? Dein Traumpartner ist ja schon für dich gebaut. Okay. Pass mal auf, Tom. Ich bin nicht auf der Suche nach einem Partner. Ich gehöre zu den Leuten, die euch drei Wochen testen und dann ein Gutachten schreiben. Und an Liebe bist du gar nicht interessiert. So they built him, built... 0,0. For a perfect... husband, I guess? Das ist etwas, wovon 93% der deutschen Frauen träumen. Dann kommst du vielleicht selber drauf, zu welcher Gruppe ich gehöre. Guten Morgen. Ich weiß nicht, ob es Ihnen auffällt, aber Sie behandeln Tom wie eine Maschine. Woran liegt das Ihrer Meinung nach? Dass er eine Maschine ist? Unterschätzen Sie ihn vielleicht? Also, wie ist das jetzt mit deinem Schwanz? Das ist also der Schwanz, den ich mir wünsche. Anscheinend. Es gibt einen Graben zwischen uns. Ich gehe hier zurück und dann werde ich gelöscht. Heißt das bei euch nicht? Liebe überwindet alle Grenzen. So sehr kann doch sprechen, oder? Tom ist ein freundlicher Roboter. Sag mal, hat er mich jetzt gerade verarscht? War einfach so naheliegend. Well, at least we know how the Matrix started. <laughs> I, just, I like kidding. it. It, it, it doesn't it, seem artificial it's, at it's, all. It, it's not. It, it seems it, very it, artificial. Um, no, what I mean is like I robot. That's what yeah, I would yeah. be assuming. It's, it's, it's naturally, unique... really naturally blended. Yeah. It's just like a race story in a way. Yeah. Black man, well, white woman. Maybe they a, accept different type of being. Maybe a little bit. It's more of a can you trust this robot? And it has nothing to do with the robot. Ethic? It's about trusting someone else. But, but it's he's also a robot. robot. Yes. He's actually a robot, but I got. The ethical I forgot about it. This of is he a ro like well, is it okay no. to love a robot or fall in love with a robot? No, what does for that her, mean? it's probably like, can he love me? Can I love exactly. him? Exactly. Well, not not he can love me. It's about her. Can she fall in love? No, no. Again? It's can he love me? Because d does he have feelings? Is he just programmed to just go through the motions? I'm curious how she, how he came to her. She it seems like she's doing some kind of research. Yeah, with it looks that. like they built him for, for her, her, and she's like the test subject to see how. And well she it didn't want to be. It doesn't look like I don't know. She didn't want to be. Yeah, kind of seems like they're forcing this. There's kind of just like here you go. I'm kind of curious to understand more of her history. It looks yeah. like she has a kid. I didn't see any kid. Uh, I don't know. I don't remember. Um, but it seems like a great love story in a way. And I forgot he was a robot. Yeah. You know, uh, so it doesn't. Forget. It didn't. I get it. I get it in different texts apparently than you. I love <clears throat> the flow of it. Yeah. And you. It looks very interesting and unique. A very different perspective, and I like the fact that. It's really easy to read. You can easy understand the subtitles. You know, you don't get lost. And I found myself really forgetting. You know, I just see a person with differences, not necessarily a robot. But he's a robot. <laughs> um, 
Anyway, moving it on. It is it's, unique that he's not trying to kill them in any way and that he's not malfunctioning in any way. I'm saying that's a good thing. I'm not saying that's a good thing. It's that's, more about a love story. Than I know. Not, I know. That's where that's where they're going with it. I'm saying a lot of people would have like thrown that in for random reasons. And it's also if she can trust herself to love someone else. Yes. Or all that. And what yes. does data have to do with? So it's analyzing a love story, not just a robot in love. At least it's a robot person and not like an amusement ride if you know what i'm talking about oh audience. brother okay since you're not taking this seriously <laughs> uh, tell us what you think of the comments leave a like share subscribe and we'll catch you next time thank you for watching the video make sure to leave a like leave a comment and subscribe now